Bud Light Heavyweight Showdown between the Axe Murderer, Vanderlei Silva, and Ryan Darth Vader. Ryan Bader, set to enter the world-famous octagon once again. Ryan Bader is an NCAA champion wrestler with very heavy hands. I've said it before, Mike, that wrestling is the perfect base to jump into MMA from. Bader has tremendous takedowns and that work ethic you need to train hard every day. Ryan Bader, fired up and ready to go. Making his way to the octagon, and he has this crowd fired up. Vanderlei is a very dangerous striker. He attacks with relentless power strikes from outside and vicious knee strikes from the clinch. He's also got a tremendous amount of experience against world-class grapplers and is well prepared to fight on the ground if necessary. Vanderlei Silva, fired up and ready to give the crowd what they came to see. Tale of the Tape is brought to you by Tap Out, an expression of combat known worldwide, now available at tapout.com. And now with the official introductions of our fighters, Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC Light Heavyweight Division. Introducing first. Fighting out of the blue corner, this man is a wrestler. He stands six feet two inches tall, weighing in at 205 pounds, fighting out of Tepe, Arizona. He is a winner of the ultimate fighter, Ryan Darth Vader. And now, fighting out of the red corner, this man is a Muay Thai kickboxer. He stands five feet 11 inches tall, weighing in at 185 pounds. Fighting out of Curitiba, Brazil. This man is a former middleweight champion of five. The ex-murderer, Vanderlei Silva! And when the action begins, our referee in charge of this contest is Kevin Mohall. Kevin Mohall, our referee. Mike Goldberg alongside my partner Joe Rogan. Round okay, one is about to begin. Ryan ready? Bader, Vanderlei Silva. And here we go. Let's fight. Oh, they're just throwing. Oh, they're exchanging here. Oh, big kick. Nice head kick. Sometimes it's better to throw shorter, quicker punches, and that's what we're seeing here tonight. When you put all that effort and energy into a punch and you really wind up, it takes more time to reach the fighter. Joe, this place is going wild. Beautiful head kick there. That one dropped him. He's hurt. He's hurt. Boom. Oh, another one. And again. Well, it looked like he was hurt, but he snapped back really quick. The crowd rallying behind Ryan Bader. Pushes him off of the feet. Oh, he lets him up. Again, King, a big right hook. Well, he got rocked, but man, he snapped back quick. The crowd now chanting for the axe murderer, Vanderlei Silva. And now that's a huge left hand. Oh, he's even hurt more. Oh, he recovers. And man, again. He loves throwing that punch. Some vicious kicks. Both guys staying in tight. And oh, he's he answers. Hurt. What an exchange here. Head kick. He is landing at will, Mike. Silva is fatigued here, Mike. Oh, head kick. It's over. Wow. Knocked him out with the head kick. How good is that? Silva with the victory. Let's take a look at the timing again. I mean, he just sets that up perfect. 
And here we see it again. And that's it. Look at this. Twist the head around. His eyes roll back into his head. The lights go out. And with our official decision, here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Kevin Mohall has called a stop to this contest at 2 minutes, 57 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout, the Ex-Murderer, Andrei Silva! The Ex-Murderer, Vanderlei Silva wins again.